And good Saturday morning to you. Welcome to this 69 News Netcast. I'm Bo Colt now. And I'm Karen Millett. If you weren't watching 69 News at sunrise, here's a bit of what you missed. Emergency crews responded to a deadly wreck on I-78 in Berks County. It happened on the eastbound lanes just past exit 40 in Greenwich Township. <clears throat> crews were called to this scene around 3.30 this morning. Several vehicles were involved in the crash, including one that ended up hundreds of feet down an embankment. We do know the coroner was called to the scene of this accident very early this morning. And police responded to an overnight fire at a school in Allentown. Now, this was the scene at the McKinley Elementary School around 1230 this morning. Now, the school is located in the 1100 block of West Turner Street. From what you can see in the video, it appears the fire was only on the roof, which was contained by emergency crews who were on the scene. For more details on both stories throughout the day, you can head to our website, WFMZ.com. Wilson Borough Police have identified a man who they say threw a punch that killed his neighbor. The search is on for the 26-year-old suspect who police say admitted to another person he delivered the fatal blow. An arrest warrant is out for Calvin Brown Jr. Police say 28-year-old Dennis Hodge Jr. died after being punched in the head by Brown and failing to falling to the ground, excuse me, outside an apartment building on 25th Street. This was all Wednesday night. Shifting gears to weather, it's going to be hot, hot, hot. 92 degrees today. Some storms could roll in this evening. Tomorrow, much cooler. 83 degrees, possible storms just north of, of Allentown there. But all in all, great poor weather, folks. For more local news, watch 69 News or get updates here at WFMZ.com. Have a great day.